Good morning, adventurers, and welcome to day two of our Halloween on the high seas on the Disney Wish. We're up very early, the kids are still in bed because we're gonna enjoy the sunrise. We're gonna have a little coffee at Cove Cafe and uh, bring you along. So let's go do day two, Castaway Key Day. Wow, this is a gorgeous shot out here of uh, not quite yet sunrise. But uh, the deck here, deck 11, aboard the Wish. And here's another pro tip we're going to found here on the Disney Wish because its deck plan here on the shows on deck 11 are very different than other ships. This right here is where we were filming. Uh, I'm getting all steamed up. This is where we were filming the uh, sailaway party. It's also not a bad place here or on deck. What are we, middle deck here? Oh, it's, there's like a middle deck here. Actually, that's a middle deck. We're on deck 12 right now. So not bad places to look at the show. You're okay for the fireworks, but probably going to need to be on the starboard side for the fireworks. But nevertheless, pro tip, great place to watch the show. Now we're going to head back to the aft here with uh, where Cove Cafe is in the adults only section. Um, not a very large section back here as they are on some other ships, but it's nice because they do have a swimming pool, which we've never done. We need to do that. We need to do that. So. And here is the adults, one of the adults only uh, whirlpools, closed right now. Nice view of the wake here. So this is the infinity pool we're talking about, or soaking pool here at the adults only section. And let me just show you a little bit here of the Cove Cafe. And one of the things that's a little bit disappointing is that they don't have the little pastries that they have on the other ships, which is really nice because they got these really cool cranberry bars that are awesome. But anyway, this is Cove Cafe. enough kids we don't have young enough kids is what I meant to be playing in the uh, little toy story splash zone but how cute is that that's so totally cute not that they didn't do a lot of time on that Nemo, Nemo slide thing on there oh my area. gosh they over they would have loved this this is little. awesome yeah this is pretty so awesome and this is forward just uh, in back of the main swimming pool deck here on deck 11. Well, we're standing on deck, what, 12 and on deck 11. Yeah, we're in 12 right now. And there's the funnel suite. The famous there's the funnel, funnel suite. suite. Someday. No, I don't know about so. someday, but Brielle is dying to stay in the funnel suite. That's all she talks about. <laughs> all right, so we're gonna head down. Gonna wake up some kiddos, gonna go to breakfast. I think we're gonna do uh, sit-down breakfast today. I don't, where's it at? Right? At, Roy, at Roy Disney. At Roy Disney. It seems to be always be at Roy Disney. I think we ate at Walt last time. Well, at 1923, I'll say that. Yeah, yeah. One side or the other. So we'll take you along and see what it is. Just a little more chilled kind of breakfast versus Marceline Martin. I do think it's hilarious that they changed these. I mean, now we didn't have very many problems with it, but there are times where we got in where it just seemed like somebody just hit, they just slid up against that old elevator panel, uh, floor panel, and man, it all lit up. This is such a cool concept. We have to do this, 23. How cool is that? So they started actually in looks like 2013, almost like. All right, so we're up and ready to go. Up headed to. Adam. We're gonna go to 1923 for breakfast. Again, that's one of the sit-down options. Marshley Market is open, but we kind of like, like I said before, a little more leisurely. Sometimes we'll hit Marshley Market probably tomorrow morning. But anyway, 1923. 
Here we go. All right, so as we're headed to 1923, we took the front elevators down. This is the Bayou. Have some pretty good beignets and some other cool drinks here. And we're gonna, well, I guess we already passed the hyperspace. So, show that later. All right. Walt Disney, 1923. Roy's on the other side. Walt's on one side. Not positively sure which side this is. This Walt or Roy? This is Walt, I guess. It says right at the top. All right, so this is Roy's side. I don't think we've ever eaten on this side before. Always been on the Walt side. 1923's kind of memorabilia stuff of uh, Disney history, animation, pictures, trinkets, whatnot. All right, good morning. And here is our breakfast for sit down option. Fresh from the griddle. And signature breakfast. All right, here's some Little Mermaid. Alice in Wonderland over there. And always have some good pastries. A little bit of the uh, Danish. And that's what I got. He's got the chocolate chip. We each got a, actually got Danishes. And raspberry, mama? It looks like raspberry. Raspberry. This view outside as we're in, parked in Castaway Key. Yeah. You can see had to get a little closer since no one was sitting over here of some of this cool scenes and gadgets or trinkets, I guess would be better word of Little Mermaid. Not sure these guys made it in the final cut. There's some Alice in Wonderland. Breeze and Keys got the same thing. French toast, only Breeze got side of hash browns, and Keys got sausage. Bon appetit, my dear. You went all in. You love your sit down breakfasts. I like to get a little bit of different things. So, oh. chocolate chip pancakes. The butter And then I have a custom omelet made, and I got ham and cheese, spinach, and peppers. So, bon appetit. And I got the eggs benedict with hollandaise sauce. Got a few choices. I think you have salmon, you can get bacon and ham. I got ham, and there's what that looks like with a side of hush brown. How cute. This is one of my favorites, Princess and the Frog. Here we have Pinocchio over here. How good. Pretty, 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 pretty cool. And here's a nice close up of the tree. And all the special little light-ups of the pumpkins. So all that commotion was for the princess gathering. It is a separate ticketed event. Don't pay for it, it's free, but you do have to sign up uh, and get a time. So that's what we're gonna wait for. And there's five, which is unusual, huh? Five. Wow, that's pretty unusual. So five princesses on this one. The cool backside view of the bayou. Or I should say other side, not back side. Other side. They do have sometimes some games, some family games here. Different things like that up there. So, and I'm just gonna call this Rich Person's Row. Because <laughs> this is a ton of jewelry shops here. More than any other Disney cruise ship we've ever been on. It's just, tons of what's clearly, man, eh, say expensive stuff. And I do love this picture. Shows you a uh, sort of a cut in half drawing picture of the uh, wish. And just some of the little nuances, some of the little cool, pretty things here. This is right outside one of the shops, right before the bayou. Actually, let me point out some way because it's not open. And we're gonna to try to maybe do it tomorrow, but our other vlog of the Wish did have us, we went into Hyperspace Lounge. Don't have to have reservations anymore. 
you can just pop in there. So we're gonna try to do that and the bayou as well. But there's Hyperspace Lounge right there. And more rich person's row. So on the, um, I'm gonna say midship stairs up to the atrium, because there really are no elevators. Be sure to take a look at some of these tapestries. Tapestries, because they're very cool. There's another one on the other side. I forget what it is. I think it's Cinderella, I think. Lady Tremaine and her daughters, Anastasia and Gisela. These are very cool. Because if I recall on the dream, all they had was like pumpkins. pumpkins yeah, this is fun. very cool. Captain Hook. Lucifer or Cheshire, yeah. Ursula. And here's just a little look-see. So we have Rapunzel, Tiana, we have Belle, Moana, and Cinderella. Of course you have to have Cinderella because she's the star of the ship. Yeah, some really very cool Wakanda art here. And then if you head back, not sure which side we're on, but it's aft. You have hooks. Barbary. And there's the hours. And further back there on is uh, Worlds of Marvel, where we were at. Oh, yeah, that is pretty cool. Avengers, assemble. So we're on deck four, right? Got that right? Head outside and take a little look-see of Castaway Key. Oh, we got the parasellers out there. Make sure to watch our other um, vlog as we did Paracel. And we'll get off here in a little bit after the princess gathering. <laughs> yeah. First time we're on the ship, I misread the un, and I said this was tangled salon, but it makes a lot more sense, untangled salon. And there it is. There's some people in there, but there's their hours. And Bibbidi Bobbidi Boutique is up here on the fourth floor as well. There's their hours. But tonight, Bibbidi Bobbidi Boutique turns into the Pirates League, where you get to dress up like pirates. Breezy's been a good sport. Yeah, Keegs did it one time too, most recently, but been a good sport. I think it's in our, did I say we did it on the last wish? Yes. So. If you want to check out the Pirates League, you can see it on our first uh, ever concierge Disney Wish Cruise in April. Hi. 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 Princess Gathering for some Hi. 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 I love all your matching clothes. Thank you. you. Perfect. Very coordinated. Yeah. Kind of like it's a snuggly duckling. Yeah. Everyone's like a big part of a band. So oh, I was yeah. thinking we could all get matching outfits oh, too. Maybe add a little something about their dreams, you know? Yeah. <laughs> do you have a big dream of your own? Yes, I do. And it's like really big. Um, you know, the best thing about dreams is you can always find a new one as well. Like after yeah. one comes through, after I saw all the lanterns, Eugene became my new dream. Aww. And now we get to see the whole world together. And Aww. he's a pretty great guy. Especially yeah. now that we don't run away from anybody. Oh, we yeah. travel a lot easier. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe take a break. Yes. Thank you. What do you think? I'll be here first. And then your paparazzi. Thank, Thank you, Rapunzel. Thank you. Thank you. It's so much fun getting to spend time with your family. Thank you. Yeah. All right, next up, Tiana. Hi. Hello. You having a good day so far? Yes, are you? Yes, I'm having a good day. What's your name? Brielle. Brielle, I'm so happy to meet you today, Brielle. Uh -huh. I love this headband you have. Thank you. Um, I'm gonna go snorkeling. Yeah, what are you doing today? Later on, I'm making some GoPro. Oh, that's going to be amazing. That's exciting. <laughs> yes, I'm so excited. You ready for a picture? Yes! Here we go. Hi, here we next have Belle. Hi, Belle. Hi, Belle. Oh, yes, please. Thank 
Thank you. I love your dress. She does a good job. Yes, she does. Yeah. I've been thinking I do need to get some matching outfits for myself and all of my friends at the castle. Can you imagine Cogsworth or Lumiere wearing something like this? Oh, yeah. <laughs> they would be very cute. I don't yeah. know that Cogsworth would like that very much. Oh, though. yeah. We might have to do a little convincing for him. <laughs> You've given me a good idea, though. I'll have to get my wardrobe to work on that. Okay. Would you like to go to work? Yes. Right? Yes. Oh, I love your pearls. Thank your you. Hair. You must have found them from under the ocean. I did. Maybe in Tamatoa's lair. I kind of did, yeah. Exactly. Well, hopefully you didn't have to go, you know, through the whole shiny song with the singing oh. and the whole choreography. Yeah, one time that shiny crab did try to eat me. Oh, that's that's terrible. Yeah. <laughs> He's a little bit of a silly guy. Yeah. Hopefully he doesn't crawl his little crab legs on board and try and steal our shiny things. Yeah. Fingers crossed. Yeah. Will we take a picture together? Yes. And there's a good look at her shoe. Really. Are you enjoying yourself so far? Yes, I am. The headband. I'm Thank a fellow of the headband myself, too. Uh -huh. so always yeah. a good choice. Uh -huh. What's the plan for today? Are we thinking of adventuring, relaxing and exploring, sampling some foods like Jack and Gus? Yeah, probably, but we're mainly going to go snorkeling today. So. Yeah. My mouse friends are learning to swim, so maybe not snorkeling for them yeah. yet, but perhaps maybe down the line. A little bit of practice makes perfect. Yeah. <laughs> well, would you like to take a board trip yes, together? Yes, please. And what a perfect timing to get who other but the Cinderella statue in the grand atrium. But be sure to look in back because we got Lucifer, who, what's the cup he's doing? Well, poor Gus Gus and Jock. And good morning, Castaway Key. Our home, sweet home. Our home away from home. Oh, we got Minnie pulling up at the back end here. Oh, Minnie, hey. And a good look at the Disney Wish. Well, can't get it all. It's so big. Our Braille charms are very small. All right, we got uh, Donald come up here before he comes up. Let me just tell you, be sure to get your towels before you go on the island because they're right here as you go. And we got Donald, number one doc, yes. A little view of uh, Rapunzel on the back of the ship. It's a nice place for a photo op. And always before we get to the, to the tram, you always got Jack on the right here, ready to take your pictures. Because it is Pirates Night. So, a bit of Marge's Barges where you get your parasailing as well as some of your other boating kind of activities. Nice little map here to get your orientation. And then our first stop here is the cargo handling. This is where you get on your trams to go to, uh, well, eventually Serenity Bay if you want to, but uh, Scuttles Cove as well as. Pelican's Plunge. Well, actually, it's called something else, but call it Pelican's Plunge. From Pelican's Plunge, then you get on another tram to go to Serenity Bay. And there's a little good view of what we're talking about here. Scuttles Cove. Why call it Scuttles Cove? Well, because if you liked leaving your kids on board at the kids club, you can do the same. Scuttles Cove. That's the kids club here on Castaway Key. Drop them off. Never see them again. Oh, we got Mickey out here. How cool. 
All right, so I was gonna like to stop in to see what they got. Private Paradise. I like that shirt. That's a pretty nice shirt. It's got Dory and Nemo on it. That's nice. It's cute. Bird of Paradise. No, Bird, Bird Parade. Bird Parade. Where's the Paradise? Can I not see? It? Oh, Paradise. Okay. Just can't see the other part of it. I know it seems a little silly getting a spirit jersey on Castaway Key, but keep in mind, you won't get anything Castaway Key anywhere else, just here. So keep that in mind. Don't buy just for the Caribbean. Buy for wherever you live. Some cool cups. Nice. We got this one. This vacay all day. You can see that very well. Got dark in here. Pretty Castaway hat. There we go. Vacay all day. Hat. The cute hat there. Oh, and they have a every day is a Sunday. Nice. With mini. That's adorable. That is adorable. With flower on it for the Another week. Disney Cruise Line, Castaway Key. Stitch. Always gotta like the stitch ones. Chilling. I love this little teeny tiny. I should say chilling like a villain since it's our. Halloween on the high seas cruise. And still have the cool ears that say. Jen, don't recommend Castaway floating on those. Castaway Key. I need a break. I need a beach break. Hey, hey, I'm there. The nice. What do you think? No, you don't need a beach break. Cool pins. And this is where you'll find exclusive castaway key pens if they're here. Although we did find one on the ship one time, didn't we? Yeah, we did. That was crazy. Do you have a castaway key? I have this one, unfortunately. It's Mickey on the beach. It says Castaway Key Bahamas. Okay, very cool. And some more shirts as well as trunks and backpacks, towels. And I did want to show here Gills, Fins, and Boats at Scuttles Cove. That's where you can get your snorkeling gear, which we're going to try to see if water should be pretty doggone nice because it's been pretty warm here. And of course, it's only middle of September, so a little picture here. of So all the way out there, you can see, well, maybe you can't see very well, but there are markers and under those markers are actually things, statues. And all the way out there is a nice scenic view of a lot of fish and stuff, but here's a good little look of Castaway Key. The family friendlies are basically Scuttles Cove as well as Pelicans Point. And there's plenty of seating. Again, this is a wish, big boat, plenty of seating. Got one right here. All right.
shellaxing. Gonna probably head over to Cookies too. One, we're gonna live wild. We're not gonna live wild, okay. We always do Cookies too. we've said in multiple vlogs. Don't really know why, other than sometimes they do, uh, they're shorter lines, feels like. But that was pretty fun, I'll tell ya. Got to see Boo's door. Hopefully I captured the film. I mean, I my mask was so um, foggy, I couldn't really see. I could hear I was filming, I know I was filming, but I don't know how well the GoPro picked up. But anyway, hopefully we picked up Boo's door. And yeah, that was the first time we ever saw uh, Daisy, right bud? Like we saw Mickey and Minnie, but I don't I don't ever seen I don't remember seeing Daisy last time. I know you and Mama. Yeah, I don't think so either. So anyway, fun time. Love to snorkel here. Just a nice leisurely <laughs> long way out there. And then you realize once you're out there, oh how fun, but now you gotta get yourself back. So anyway, onwards to nice view of the ship. All right, let's go take a look at what they got at Cookies 2 Buffet. serve ice cream that they have. Bananas to die for. Right, Breezy got a cheeseburger. It looks like a brownie. Coleslaw. And the chips. And Keeg's chips. Hot dog. Is that a bean salad or something? something like that. And chocolate chip. Yeah. I mean, I usually get a cheeseburger when we come here, so I had to get a cheeseburger. Um, and then I love the potato and the macaroni salads. The barbecue chips are back. Last time they just had regular. And then I got some fruit and a brownie and some kind of, I think it's raspberry and pineapple. They're good. There will be ice cream. All right. And I got really my use. Hot dog, love the barbecue. Got these raspberry pineapple little muffins. Then I went for some fruit, and like Mama said, barbecue flavor is back. All right, we all got the same thing, just they tore into the kids theirs. Yeah, they brought a nice so, theirs. Banana. Banana, cheers. Banana. All things must come to an end. We're headed back to the ship. If you're hot, if you're tired from snorkeling, you can walk, or you can take the shuttle. We're taking the shuttle. Tram. Well hydrated on your day out on the island. All right, playing bingo in there, Luna. After a nice little rest and nap, we're headed for Pirates Night. Gonna do some Pirates character pictures, something our kids always love. And uh, then I think we're gonna skip the show. We're gonna head to uh, the uh, uh, movie at one of the theaters, Haunted Mansion. This is the first time we've ever been on the Disney Wish theater, movie theaters, so that'd be kind of cool. Hey, Donald! Oh, so nice. Oh, so nice. I'm telling you, ready for a movie. Oh, we got Captain Hook. And Mr. Smee. Captain Hook and Mr. Smee, down there. Wait, yeah. Bye, you hey, guys. Gooster. I got that for you. Thank you. Hey, Gooster. Of course. Yeah, we're, we're ready for pirate looks, night. Okay, looks like we're ready. You know how to salute your captain uh, like a brave pirate. Yeah. 
That's good. Right. That's good. I think they'll work on it a little bit more. We'll yeah. work on it. Are you going to look for treasure? Thank you, Shake Thank you, Shake Boo. Oh, yeah. That's going to help. Yeah, yeah. You got to dig the treasure. Goofy, you there we go. Booty already? You got it. The night is young. The night is young. Uh, we'll shake it more later on deck. All right. Though. Yeah. You got it. Up there, yeah. There. It's going to be. Awesome. All right, so I think this is what we're going to do in place of the show tonight. We're going to see the Haunted Mansion. All right, so this is our first time in the Wonderland Cinema. A little picture here, a little view from outside. All right, so let me show you a little bit of the theater here. This is Wonderland Cinema. The other one is Neverland Cinema. So there's two of them, unlike all the other ships, just have one. Pretty cute. All right, so we're on deck for Mickey and Minnie's Pirates in the Caribbean. We love this show. It's a little different on the Disney Wish than it is on the other cruises, but nevertheless, it's still a fun little show. All right, here we go. Yeah. 
Here's our bread service for tonight, as well as an onion dip. And it's looking delicious. There's not many seats that are going to get a good opportunity to really fully enjoy the show. So, music, great, but you saw all we're going to probably see of uh, um, Anna and uh, Kristoff. So, that's about After it. Being here three times, one of the things that we felt would be a good idea, these places that are so far back that you can't see anything, at least having a TV that you could at least see and enjoy the show um, would certainly be at least a little better. I mean, certainly, you know, you'd, you'd want to be up close, but it's just the way they've constructed the thing. I don't know how else you would do it. It's dry. This one. It was Sven. Come on, little snowman. Need to work on your juicing skills. I think we need to work on your straight skills. You say so, little snowman, dearest. What did you get? So, got the white and green asparagus. And it's got some radish and tomato on it. Brielle's going to have the same. Because I'm just going to show yours because we got the same thing. Actually, everybody got a tart. They just got the asparagus right there. And there's the ham tart. So the ham tart was delicious, as I remember it. Let's see what Breezy, uh, well, let's see what they all think about the ham tart, and then they got the asparagus. All right, dude, what you think? You didn't get this last time. Um, it was pretty bad. I wouldn't get it again. I ate every bit of it. <laughs> so, dude, what did you think about this tart that you ate every bit of it? It was really good. I was impressed. It's amazing. So you got the double hitter here. Asparagus, and I don't think you got the ham last time, huh? I did. You did, okay. Mm -hmm. I like both of those. I actually think I had both of them last time. Go on. Go on. All right, Breeze. What did you think about the ham and the asparagus? I hated it. Yep. That's why it was all gone. <laughs> yeah. That's our that's our Disney food critic right there. Yep. I I I hated it, but I ate it all. I'm very strict about my food. You're very. It has to be, it has to be cooked right. Okay. That's why you cannot eat it if it's if it is not 40 degrees. That's that's why you had those sour patch kids the other day. Huh? Yeah. Yeah, okay, well, except your desserts. Your desserts can be nice. Okay. Very challenging. All right, now what did you really think? Good? 
Yeah. I'll awesome. show this one. This is this is the ultimate mac and cheese right here. This is what all three of the rest of us got, the non-mac cheese people. And I will put in the exact name because I can't pronounce it. It's Arendelle something, but I can't pronounce it all. Our desserts for Arendelle and signature dessert. This violinist goes nuts. This is awesome. it up here at Arendelle even though we were back in the I don't know what's the suburbs of Arendelle the section. It's, it's suburbs of Arendelle is where it was so still had fun mac and cheese yeah good Arendelle makes good mac and cheese mama this was good stuff man my go-to this is the same this one I've ordered stuff, all three yeah. times we've been here now it's always been great I this this is one of my favorites I gotta tell you breezy I ate it, not my stomach hurts. It's all in your stomach? But it was good. It was good. All right. And there's that damage there. Next up. All right. So, again, if you're really interested in being up close to the stage, definitely put that request in as early as you possibly can. You know, all requests are subject to Disney's discretion, whatever. But I'm kind of okay with the bleed section over here. It was less noisy. Didn't get to have a lot of character interactions. But... You know what? It was all right. So Keegs and Brielle both got Elsa's coronation Sunday. Whoa! Right there it is. You went double again. I know. So just between the double and the special, right? Well, we got the same. We both got the apple cake. And then I also got the butter cake. I'll turn it around. It's got this cute little. Is this her signature? No. 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 All right. Let's do it. A little bit of the ambiance as we're walking out. Of Arendelle. The stage here. And Elsa Nana. Cute here on deck seven. Kanto picture, family house. But for me, Casita. Deck seven and eight. What a cute picture of Encanto. Alright, so we're up here on deck 12. Pirates rocking a party party. We don't tend to do this, just catch a couple of songs. Then we're going to turn around starboard side and we're going to watch the fireworks. So, not one of our favorites. they're going to start the fireworks when they start introducing the different captains and you see if it's not so windy
Castaway Key. I love snorkeling. Snorkeling at Castaway is just so fun. I don't know whether it's between that and parasailing, but oh, yeah. that is, uh, I really hope, uh, it was very hard to see because my goggles were all fogged up, so I really hope I was able to catch some good video. So a lot of fishies up and close, and then first time got to see Boo's door, and uh, again, I don't think we saw Daisy in him last time. I mean, we saw the no, other guys. No, and I didn't so get to see Dumbo last time, and we got to see Dumbo this time, so that was pretty cool. So definitely be prepared uh, to ease way out there but then once you're out you gotta get back so that's a chore uh but anyway you know good food as usual at uh, cookies two and then on board Arendale, well we got the suburbs this time that's all i'm gonna say it was a great dining experience i do love it like, we enjoy the food very yeah. much it's just i don't know how else they could do it i mean it's just a big ship it's a little stage i don't know how else they could do it yeah. but it is what it is, but just be sure to, again, as I've said multiple times, request uh, to be close up to the stage. And then uh, we're done with the pirates part. We're not going to say any more about that. Fireworks, awesome. Fireworks are amazing. We didn't mention Haunted Mansion, which we oh, all yes, like that's true. Haunted yes. Mansion. That was, I was surprised. Yeah. I was pleasantly surprised. Was I mean, nice. I kind of like the Eddie Murphy one too, but that was I like good. the storyline. There were yeah. a lot for those that are like actual Haunted Mansion the yeah. right fans. There was a lot Lots, of... Yeah. Um, takeouts from yeah, that that was so, very good. that was so, really neat that was uh, and again that was in place of again we not would not ever discourage you if you've not ever gone to little mermaid definitely do the broadway shows but it's just it's not our favorite so we decided to do haunted mansion so i think that wraps it right it's a very full day a so day. i think we'll go out actually with a little firework action on pirate's night tomorrow day three at sea our yes, fave. this is a three-night sailing, and we get a sea day, which is like unheard of. So and, we're excited about and that. And it's Halloween. Halloween, so please like, subscribe, hey, hit that hey. notification bell as we are up for venture. And what do we always say? Onward to our next adventure. Bye. Bye.